All right, guys, you want to talk about The Walking Dead Season 9, Episode 7. Go ahead and read my notes. So this was an interesting episode. Um, yeah, it was. I like I like how that Daryl is like the man of the land. Yeah. You know? He has a dog. Yeah. And I was really worried for a moment. I was like, oh, God, don't tell me they're going to kill the don't dog off in the first dog. episode. We see the dog. And then I was like, eventually the dog's probably going to die. And he's going to John Wick the fuck out of somebody. <laughs> <laughs> and you're just like, you just know it. Yeah. Uh, or the dog will be around forever, and it'll become an endearing character that saves people all throughout forever. Do you like that that he calls the dog dog? I do. I really I, do. I wrote that down. I'm like his dog dog. I'd like to know where he <laughs> got a dog. Found him. Uh, I guess living. <laughs> found him through 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 him some zombie toes. I found a, a puppy <laughs> mill. Here we go. Ah. Oh. It's great. So <laughs> that's Carol and Henry on their journey, right? Mm-hmm. We saw them in the last episode. They they hey stranger or whatever. Yeah. And you're kinda like, What's going on? Why why are they here? She's literally like Daryl's been out there too long. Henry needs someone to kinda look you know, watch over him. I can kill two birds with one stone. I can pull Daryl back into the communities yeah. and give Henry like a role model maybe or something, right? I have to go back to the kingdom. Sure. It's, it's a great plan. It's wonderful. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and she goes there. We get a bunch of dialogue, a bunch of like bonding, rebonding, exposition. Uh-huh. He's like, I know you think, I think he's still out there. All right. We never found a body. All that stuff, right? Which is like, ah, that's cool. Yeah, because right? he's still out there. We're we, time- we know that. Well, he, he's literally still out there. <laughs> but Daryl is maybe, well, you know, was certainly looking for him for some period of time. He was probably sure. going down river, being like something's up or whatever. I wonder if he... Uh, I guess he didn't see any signs of any of the actual stuff, right? Because they would have had to have landed the helicopter, loaded him on, <laughs> done all these things. Yeah. That would have left, like, tracks, I guess, or whatever, but it was fine. I don't, know. I don't even know if yeah. that's something that he would be in his wheelhouse and be like, that's a helicopter, like, yeah. you know? Some sort of weird wagon that just appeared and disappeared. <laughs> yeah. Um, so... I I thought we we got in touch with our new characters a little bit more, and yes. like like they definitely became endeared to the group. And I, yeah. I almost thought you'd get Michonne to change her mind there and be like and like say yeah. something like, and if they don't take you there, you can come back to blah blah. I or think like that might be like the that. the round trip. There might be something mm-hmm. going on, or one person might stay for some reason, and someone else might move on for some like right. They might split them up or whatever. It, like the, it was really the fanboys yeah. thing about like the instruments that I think really is like, like uh-huh. oh you really care about changing the future. Maybe making yeah. people better and bringing us all together. Like, where it's like, yeah, you know, you are the kind of people we want in Alexandria. And she looks at him disgusted. Like, after all this, you care about a stupid thing? And he's like, yeah, let me give a monologue. They're like, three minutes long. I'm yeah. going to talk for it. It's great. It's wonderful. And, like, there's obviously writers here or whatever. Cause, so, like, the now that I'm on AMC.com, mm-hmm. I can see the, the, the title of all the episodes. <laughs> And 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 uh, you know next week mid season finale episode eight is called evolution or something like that mm. and this guy literally gives a speech about uh, you know Homo sapiens and the Neanderthal and how we would have interacted and how what makes us interesting and special is like art and music and culture and all that stuff yeah which maybe is, my uh, theory is very wrong. on the nose or it's a giant misdirect I would be very happy if your theory was right I just don't give them like I can't have as the linchpin of my theory some like production quality thing on their part uh-huh. where it's like ah oh, they're too articulate. I'm like, ah, oh, they just wanted us to hear that that zombie, right? Yeah. That's far more whatever. I, w- I, w- I would love for something. I would love for this to not be true. I so, do have a tendency so to read into <laughs> things that, that, like, you know, like how I would do them, but yeah. then, yeah, like, give well, people more credit than they they are uh, do. You're probably thinking, well, that doesn't make sense. That doesn't fit with this show to have the zombies start mm-hmm. talking. So it, it has to be something else, right? Um, kind of. Yeah, and I and I feel the same way. I'm not sure how they're going to do it, but uh, if we skip to that at the end, right, there's, you know, you saw, like, the next time on yes. whatever's, right? So it's 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 like whether or not those characters are, like, Yeah, being there were misled. no more, like, I didn't get any tells from yeah. the, the flash forward of, like, of what's going to happen next episode. Yeah. You saw tactics that also could be perceived as evolution or it could still be a, totally. a group mentality thing because, like, they were searching for Eugene and, and there's a, it's a not, part where they're just meandering and he's a, uh, or something. It's not a normal herd. They're after me or whatever. Yeah, <laughs> I like, like that. that. <laughs> yeah, and like so. the lighting was like very uh, like oh we're, we're in the darkness. Oh <laughs> Things yeah, are bad. Very flat Gotta dark run. lighting or whatever. That um, blue for night stuff. Uh, it's gonna be the finale though. Uh, it's interesting. Finale, yeah, um, yeah. The a a spike of like the whole thing. 
<laughs> yeah. I'm interested where that's going to go. I don't know how much they're even going to know about what's causing anything to happen or not. Or how would they like know that. anything for real? Right. Honestly, though, so they're going like, to have to draw like it's not like there's science things or things yeah, to yeah, do yeah. or ask or they're whatever. They're not going to be able to analyze stuff, so they're going to interpret it however it feels like it's yeah. happening, which will be fine because like getting into the details could make you know will make that like worse inevitably. Right, I, and I would Unless even say, uh, even if it is people, if if yeah. like my theory is correct, like you shouldn't know that until like, like if there's ten, if there's twelve episodes in the season, you shouldn't know until like episode like nine or ten, okay. like it because it, it's way scarier. Yeah, to play it up time. as 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 this other angle, yeah, yeah. or it is that angle, and and that's just what's gonna happen. Yeah, so I I feel like so hopefully, uh, so this, so so they know that everyone's infected because of the, of like CDC man. Yes. Right. Maybe Eugene can draw some conclusions from what they see or find or something like that. But I can't imagine because, like, where where could this go? We have to parlay with the leader of the of the zombies or something. Oh no no! It, like, it that's would awful. it would solely just yeah. be a a a more uh, accurate Cowboys versus Indians thing where there would now be tactics and actual right. things and we have to do this that and the We're other. We're just thing. making the zombies harder because uh, yeah. we need to because otherwise. Again, right? With I don't all even these, hate that though. With, with as, all these as a concept, yeah, with all these organized settlements and with life being kind of like one of you know can you think of a bigger reason to get them to join back together than we're getting fucking invaded by smart motherfuckers like yeah zombies are like uh, mice now they just go can you go clear out the zombies over there okay hold on zombies oh zombies got in the thing oh yeah they're eating the grain again the place is full of zombies (laughs) you know (laughs) and like it's like rare that like something happens or, or or like whatever but you know relatively rare I was so, glad. So like, to step it up. Real quick to go back to the dog yeah. for a second. When like I'm like, why would he keep the dog tied up like that? This seems like a terrible <laughs> idea. And then like later he's like, he's like, oh, he got caught in some traps. And I'm like, yeah. okay, he just happened to hit like two traps that pinned him like I, exactly perfect. That might be a, ty- a type of trap. I-, I was confused by that. Maybe whole, it is. I was confused by that whole thing because even the foot trap, like at, as you would see, is not super effective for a zombie or something like that. So there's a weird no, like back yeah. and forth of like uh, traps everywhere. I think. St- do you think something's gonna happen with Henry's foot being in the trap, some weird thing or whatever? No, no, because like, he's like dead now. Anything that bad would have happened, like Daryl would know about. Like he didn't poison it. Like yeah, I was gonna to say the other thing. Uh, yeah. And he gave him some salve to put on it. Yeah, so. a little bonding thing. So or I think whatever. I think he'll be fine. Yeah, uh, you may get may, maybe an infection will happen or something. But I, even then, I, I, just because Daryl's so man of the fucking earth that I, I think he he'd be like, I know how to fight that, whatever. Yeah, and then yeah. they're they're in a settlement now where there is a doctor. So even then, so they should be fine. So yeah. I think that's just gonna be a. Uh, it was a weird thing to show me like that, but I guess it makes sense. It felt like an uh oh, like like you know moment that, that that's gonna come back later, mm. but. Um, I guess it shouldn't, which is better. It, yeah, it shouldn't, but not to say good. that it can't. This show has some interesting directions sometimes, so it's certainly possible. Speaking of being at a settlement, they are at the Settlement Hilltop. We have to yes. see Hilltop. Hilltop, it's, Maggie's it's, gone. I was going to say, it, with Georgie. It is It is not a post-apocalyptic war zone as I had hoped. There's yeah. not smoke belching out of weird metal and fire everywhere, which is fine. There's more form than they, they had before. They made their choice. Uh, yeah, it looks pretty swank. We yeah. get some some wide shots now, right? We see where they're saving their budget and not showing wide shots of the kingdom because we already have the hilltop stuff. So we're gonna yeah. and make Jesus that is look in nicer. charge now. Jesus is is the reluctant like uh, bratty king <laughs> of yeah. like the hilltop, basically. He's training um, training Aaron on the slide. Yeah, so that was interesting. Yeah, Aaron's got to get because like they've been grooming Aaron to be a leading man for yeah. quite some time now, so he's got to get into it. I did like in the flash forward of next it? episode, you see him like put his fake hand like in a zombie's mouth and then stab it. Like I was like, which yeah. he should be doing, definitely. Exactly. Do you? How do you feel? His fake ab- hand looks too much like like his hand wearing a glove, though. Like yeah. they should do a little something extra to that. Mm. I agree. Um, because it's just a hand wearing a glove. It, well, that, that's what it is. And that's the problem. <laughs> yeah, that's a, like a TV thing where I can kind of like forgive that to some degree yeah. or whatever. But yeah, like him, him. I remember like being like, "What?" When he like jumped and like knocked Jesus off the horse and he they're jumped fighting. And so stuff. high. It was so crazy. He, like like that yes. was completely off a springboard. Think about how high a horse sits. Yeah, and and he, and he flew over the horse to knock Jesus off the horse. And the explanation is, uh, I'm training him or whatever. Yeah. So like, so not only have we, we sneak attack each other every day. 
<laughs> that's like that thing, right, from whatever that uh, old show is where I pay him to uh, lie in wait to keep me on my toes. Or, <laughs> that was from uh, uh, Lois and Clark Adventures. There was, there oh. was his, his men it's servant. Been, it's been in more things than that, but yes. <laughs> it's, an old, it's like a tropey thing. It's like a hilarious, uh, weird thing. But So not only did we finally remember that Jesus is like a crazy ninja, mm-hmm. but he's actually training someone else. Yeah. I'm okay with Aaron being in this position. I sure. uh, I I I heard that actor I like talk him. on so, yeah panels and yeah. Talking Dead, and he seems like a cool dude. Does a lot of seems fun to, impressions. Yeah, seems to have some range and all that stuff, and and just what he's done so far. So I'm like, okay, this is fine. Uh, weird though, right? So like, as we learn more about how the situation is, it seems like um, people are like we have to bring the communities back together. But meanwhile, the communities are 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 very much <laughs> like people are aware of gossip and hanging yeah. out sometimes, and they're not that far away, and <laughs> all this stuff's milling no, about. and right? what's stopping anyone from just yeah. socializing? Because you could have had friends before the split. Exactly. And it's been seven years, or you know, give or X, whatever. X years. Yeah, yeah, it's been X years. <laughs> no, and like, uh, like seeing Hilltop and then like saying, oh yeah, you know, there. Oh yeah, that guy's there. Oh yeah, that's where the... Because there's certain characters you haven't seen, and you go, okay, so people picked or like ended up in different spots and have yeah. just stayed there, right? But yeah, you're, you're friends with people. When they saw Rosita they're like, oh shit, and like, and like, yeah. yeah. It wasn't like, oh, Rosita, yeah, you, Rosita of of Alexandria. <laughs> so, what did you think about Maggie not being around? I How lazy does that feel to you? Uh, that it's like, oh no, she took her young child and then went to help establish a new community with the people that send letters somehow. Yeah. What? No, it's. I mean, it's dumb. I don't know why. I assume uh, what's her name didn't want to do the show, right? Wasn't there a rumor that she was leaving yes. as well? And maybe she did, but yeah. kill her. Like, like don't play well, games. It was bad. And maybe she'll come back for an episode here yeah. or there. But uh, it just feels so dumb. Like it was. It was bad enough to write off Rick the way they did, where it's still huh, huh, like something's happening. Yeah. To do that in like in like the standard television way of mm-hmm. just like everyone has dialogue about like oh Michonne doesn't know Maggie's gone or whatever, right? The whole thing. Yeah, yeah. No. I, I, I hate it. I don't know what else to say. I'm, I not, just think I'm not at all shocked. That particular reason seems just so yeah. crazy to me where I'm like, like, hey, I don't really like the Georgie character that much to begin with. Yeah, it's a dumb, um, uh, and it's I, a dumb thing. I really hate this idea of mail because <laughs> do you see how many letters and stuff are like being Big shipped back and letters, forth? Yeah. And you're like, all right, so every time there's any letter, the twins are, are going all the way here to drop it off and then all the way back. From Why a, would from you ever do that? Well, you see, they're building the future, Stefan. I don't think that's the future. I think that's a, the best way to die for no reason. Yeah, you would think. Especially with um, now smart hordes and this and that. I hope the smart hordes. I hope that they don't uh, keep... So, like, you know, now I see why they were even mentioning it in the first place. Because the plan was always to have Maggie be gone uh-huh. with her and all that stuff. So she was talking about, like, hey, there's another letter from... from okay, yeah, I'll read it later. Like, they had that, you know, those mentions of it yeah. in, like, the past. Because they had to set this up. or like Yeah, and that letter presumably <laughs> was, come with me. Yeah. I'm starting a new civilization. Uh, you and your small child. Sh- would, it would be great to be undefended w- by walls. Would be, of, would be of a lot of help. Yeah, I'm like... Th- things like that make me afraid that that's going to come into play. Or this new community is going to come into play. They're going to try to spin something off or take us to the new place for now, a while. If we ever see her again, it'll be like, I just yeah. couldn't be in the same state as Negan. I had to go somewhere else. Somewhere where, where Glenn could be appreciated. There's like a little statue to him. <laughs> like, what? Yeah, we don't even know how all that... What's happening or whatever. Like, when did she leave? Why did she spend years after but not leaving? And I guess the communities were separated for that long. Seemingly because Michonne and Maggie's, like, beef and all that stuff. And now Maggie's gone. And, like, the day after, Jesus wasn't like, uh, hey, y'all got something to trade? What do you want to do? Yeah, no, it's very, very goofy. It, it just feel, it felt lazy to me. And, like, no one told Michonne for how long? Was it years? How long has it been? Yeah, years, weeks, days, months, I don't know. hours. Who's to say? <laughs> Who's to say? Whatever is convenient for, like, everything else to fit together. Yeah. No, yeah. That's probably the one of the worst uh, things. You saw, like, over these years, mm. they've made, like, like different armor. Like, Jesus preparing for war has, like, like a, like a metal Inca kind of thing. You're like, what yeah. is that? It doesn't have any back to it? It's just open back? What? So like, what are these chest... <laughs> pro- how often are you bit in the chest? Like, <laughs> like they, they emphasize the chest protector so much. I would want arm protection. You want, you want limb protection yeah. as much as possible. I want, yeah. like, limb and neck, because that seems to be, like, what gets bit. Yeah, exactly. You want, like, uh, big anime arms. Yeah, gu- like gauntlets. Or yeah. Gauntlets. Because they don't even they don't even need to be crazy. It, like, because you could still feel a bite if you're just wearing rubber. You would feel the bite, but it wouldn't be infecting you. Yeah, it would be enough to like uh, get winged and just fight back or yeah. whatever, right? You you don't have they're to, not like, superhuman yeah. biters. You like, don't have you don't have to lay there the whole time. 
<clears throat> and just let them keep trying to bite through. Yeah, maybe mount some cheese graters to my arms. And then when Ooh, they try to bite me, I just go... I'm <laughs> the shredder. Yeah. So, speaking of all that, though, I love how the like two hilltop spearmen show up. Did you know that's... um? Oh, my God, he's famous. I can't remember his name. He looks familiar, he, but... Oh, God, he's in so many B-movies. He was in The Hitcher. He was in... Uh, <coughs> um, uh, Soul Man. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, he's one of those three-name people, I'm pretty sure. <coughs> Michael Clark Duncan. Yes, that was him. From Bre- the grave. Brendan Fraser Fraser. No. Uh, I forget his name, but uh, he's, he's super so, famous. He's super good. Yeah. They, well, they show up, and like it, 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 that finally, that one moment, for some reason, this dumb thing, finally felt to me like a different like show. Uh-huh. Where you had like people show up with like whatever, and they were like, "Ah, what brings you, traveler?" And he had the whole flight, like uh-huh. they go back and forth, and like I like it like all clicked in my head where I could literally see how people ended up with weird like surnames like they have. Okay, like it's like Maggie of the Hilltop and like blah blah of Alexandria, the right? widow of Hilltop, the widow of Hill. Like those like, those like weird things, not like weird caveman stuff, but just how stuff naturally evolves and like they were using a certain type of shorthand and like they just had a thing of like okay well like go deliver your message but i'm gonna add to it and say this and then i'm gonna keep go- right they like decided yes, to like split yes. the ways or whatever they were like i feel like the show a long time ago when everyone's still wearing blue jeans and hanging out would have been like oh we're on the way there just come with us we'll just go back but this had like this official like i'm a messenger from the leader of the of like the can- like it had a weird like civilization yeah. vibe to it that i really clicked with and liked a lot i'm like okay no no and they, they, different they looked they looked super legit with their <laughs> Like and the, how well, they were, and the yeah. spears, and like, and they do oh, have wearing bronze, like what is <laughs> well, that? And they do have like uniforms, right? Yes, they, and they have a blacksmith there. So you're like, okay, like everything's this nice. It's like fitting for me or whatever. Did you find the dude? It is, uh, I believe, C. Thomas Howell. Oh, C. Thomas Howell. <clears throat> I know all about C. Thomas Howell. I, I did not clock him uh, in the slightest. Yes, that's uh, perfect. Yeah, he's you know he's he's older now, obviously, but but no, he's he's been in super awesome things for a yeah, long time. Yeah, that's great. So that wasn't just like a bit character. That's an actual dude. No, yeah, that, like that was part of my thing. I was like, I've arriving, never seen yeah. him before. Uh, yes. but like obviously he's going to be a character that matters because he's a fucking famous guy. Right, like, like, this, like that other guy that matters. Yes, so. the, the the musician guy. I was, yeah. I was like, all right, we're getting real people now. The show is investing I, in new characters. I thought the musician might have died when she. I thought she cut off one of his hands or, or, or and like he'd never be able to play exactly. an instrument again. Yes, yes, yes. Because he's like, oh, yeah. or at the very least, like a scar across the face. Something, right? Yeah. But she, but she did something way worse to him. This is a she cut his Stradivarius. <laughs> she cut his Stradivarius. Yeah, no, but uh, I still can't get over. It. Even like Sadiq was like, "You've been traveling with musicians with, with with instruments this whole time. Like, what's wrong with you, or whatever?" It's 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 yeah. It's I understood it. Yeah, it's great. It's I'm, like, I'm like, yeah. I was yeah. thinking, I'm like, I'm like, if I came across like you know, like, oh, you got Detective Comics number one. Like, yeah, I'd grab it. Why wouldn't I grab it? I'd take over fucking anything. <laughs> yeah, I'd, I'd I'd risk my life constantly to do that whole thing. I'd get so, a nice little plastic pouch. And Sadiq's really come into his own. I like his character. Yeah, a lot no, now. he's grown. I liked him at first, and I, but I was like, I don't know what they're gonna do with him. But I feel like like certain characters, it just feels like they came back to set the next day and kept filming. And certain characters, uh-huh. you can feel in them that time has gone by. And he's one of those yes, characters yes. that is ca- he like carries himself different. He relates to different characters differently, and I'm like, ah, acting. <laughs> like, no, I, I like it. Yeah. yeah, a couple of characters, like, you don't look any you're different just from dude, you're just being the exact years. same dude. And yeah. some people look the same after <laughs> years. Like, Yeah, like, it, like, like the look is part of it, but it's the whole, like, you know, mm-hmm. you would think things, you know, things change, right? Sure. So, like, you, sh- you should feel, right? Like, if you time travel from, 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 like, eight years in the future, you should notice something besides the fact that you're eight years older. Mm-hmm. Maybe, you, you, know, you, you, you know, you don't look that different, but you're, sure. you're different or something like that. Yeah, yeah. something. So uh, uh, what else it all happened? boils down to a fight. The next morning, there's a herd yes. at the thing, and we get to see, we see these, their, their, these their elements with their specific yeah. weapons. They hand out their weapons, and it's like a video game. The one like uh, and you know nameless NPC guy in charge of like the wagon drops down the bag, and it's like weapons here, and in then a car- trunk, <laughs> and, and but like 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 drops it and and like opens it like it's a Call of Duty health pack, and they all run up and think uh-huh. think 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 and and like grab yeah, their so things. We got an archer. We got yeah. two uh, wrist rockets yes. we got a knife thrower the dude has like what did he have a hammer or, he had or a, a pickaxe something <laughs> i wrote all that down and 
like and like he's last. His name's Luke, I think. And, okay. and I said Luke has a hammer and a can-do attitude. <laughs> when he closed those, when, when, opened. When, when he opened to form a a, a like barrier, yeah. those doors was like eh, and just like gave him like a fuck you, you're a zombie, you can't get through. And they're like, Ugh, and they're like, he's like, Neh. like yeah, I'm a fan. <laughs> that was wonderful because he's whole. He's like holding shit. And he's like, no, no, I'm not doing this. I have a hammer just in case. But I don't, I don't, I don't fuck with that. It's amazing. No, That's and amazing. It's great because the doors open that way. They're gonna keep pushing into it yes. and not get anywhere. <laughs> it's wonderful. But he was doing like, all right, all right, all right, good. Like it was so good. That uh -huh. uh, that moment alone, it, you know, so it you know in endeared me to that character, right? Sure. Because because that could have been like, oh, he's just Eugene, but with music or whatever, right? It could be very yeah. like whatever. But you get so much personality out of that, you know. I feel like um, him and Eugene will click. Exactly. There'll be a whole yeah. thing. Uh, no, it's wonderful. But, like, that's the whole thing. Like, when you have the new characters, you can't just have them be, like, oh, it's, she's kind of like Andrea, only with this. Or, like, oh, she yeah, has yeah. that, but instead of a sword, it's that, or whatever, right? Like, now, having have two a real like, a slingshot things. actually is a great it's apocalypse great! weapon. Because you can grab shit and just do well, it, yes. right? Yeah. And, and, like, even if you have, like, legit ammunition yeah. for one, it doesn't take up a lot of space. It's yeah. not that heavy. And then you can just grab rocks and bullshit around. I was super impressed, cause be, because, again, there's, like, no duplication. Mm -hmm. And she has a bow bow instead of like uh, Daryl's crossbow. Yes. And Daryl's crossbow now is just even like he's just so kidded that he just doesn't even waste ammo if yeah. he doesn't need to, right? So uh, and like we we see her with the bow, not even just like kill you no know, like, kill a zombie. What was that she even? Knocks knocks like, over I was like, yeah. what yes. kind of bullshit okay. is that's a shot you wouldn't even attempt? Like she's it, she's so good is what they're trying so to say. Good. She's so damn good. And she I wasn't somehow, even clear what exactly she shot that I don't caused that because no. it happened like so quickly, but I was like. Like what would even do that? Did she have an exploding arrow? Like I, she's like t -t 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 -t, takes the right type of arrow, freezing yeah. arrows. No, so that's dumb. I know, mm -hmm. but but I know that the show is trying to tell me that she's very good and that's yeah, she is a sniper. Yes, that she can do a thing. Mm -hmm. So that's great because I I thought we, we were just going to drop these people off and it was just going to be whatever things or whatever. Uh -huh. But it, but they're they're really integrating it in well. I was the most skeptical about you know added adding new characters this way. Right. I, I, I actually like the idea of new blood because it also is like, okay, I don't know who's, if any of these people are safe like because they're brand new. They yeah. could be designed to die. Who knows? Yes, exactly. Um, or does this mean other characters are leaving and we're going to kill them off we and we're replacing them? making room or whatever, yeah. I like the idea that these guys have been, with together, been together long enough that they have picked up and learned sign language because yeah. that like, that's a very cool tool, yep. especially when you have smart zombies that ah. could like, hear you and listen. They could be like... Yep. You know, whatever. Something's going to come up where, where that silent language is going to be even more crucial. Or whatever, Definitely. Right? Yeah. No, I dig it. No, you end up with... So it's sign language, and you have, you know, f uh, what is it, four of them or five? Five of them that all use, like, very silent weapons, too. Oh. So, like, they, they're, like, a great, like, you know... <laughs> Okay. Interesting. I throw my knife. Killed it silently. I hit him with the X. Silently. I... Ting, silent. Yeah. Arrow. Silent. Plays this plays a violin. Silent. Silent. No, I the world's <laughs> smallest violin. He plays half the violin. Um, no, yeah, I, my first thought was like, oh, being deaf is a huge liability in this apocalypse or whatever. Mm -hmm. But uh, it, it's for bringing, her, yes. It's but bringing, for, it, it has well, made everybody else she's, slightly she's more screw, advantageous. Just, yeah. Thing, yeah. Well, and and it wasn't just like that's her thing. She's deaf. Like all the characters are doing all these different things. They're interacting in different ways. Mm -hmm. When like uh, decisions have to be made, they disagree and they and they use their personalities. Where he's like, yeah. number two, number two, anybody? Number two side, the good side? No. Okay, like they have, and and then she's like giving her speech, like, like the leader lady now with the with the head wound. Yeah, right. So you have this nice. It's nice. I'm I'm super impressed. I would have rathered they slowly added characters over time, f you know, during the last three years. But given the situation they were in, I think that's a good way to do it. I was worried about a big dump of characters, but this is this is super well done. Yeah, cause it's it's nice because you have a dynamic that already exists that's clashing with a new dynamic, yeah. and, and now it's a dynamic we don't even know about because like there's the, the world's changed so much. We have a, a you know a council and we vote and whatever. Yeah. When like you know it just six episodes ago they would have been like welcome friends you're gonna blah 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 I'm Rick I believe like, the best in everybody I let people that tried to kill me work on a bridge you would like, have asked them I have some questions for you yeah. I, I thought they were gonna ask the you know like uh, like by the way four episodes ago whatever uh -huh. uh, during that council thing they were gonna ask like the questions that they used to yeah. ask like how many did you kill what's this what happened here and like whatever his like rundown was mm -hmm. but they avoided that for you know for some reason as if to say things are different we're now. past that now we're past that now and maybe one day we'll know why 
Well, but I, I I like the pace that we're finding stuff out. No, no, this is really good. Me. I'm super impressed. I was super down. These are some of the best episodes we've had in a little yes. while, and uh, I think it's going to build up to something. Hopefully, very nice. We have to see how this intelligent zombie thing works out. Exactly. Or and my tidbits are: Does Daryl have ha, also have X scars, but in like in like different he does. places? Yeah, that's but they're not gonna the be, same as Michonne's. I, no, so what, that's so going to be a this? thing. I think that that led to the change of everything. I think yeah. they they got attacked by some party or whatever, and that like they mutilated them is what is going to be my guess. That's crazy. So she didn't give him a kidney. <laughs> no, but that's like it's very. This is the, this is strange. Mm -hmm. We need to know what happened. What is hanging over everyone that's causing? Did he this have scars much, on uh, his face too? Because the boy he asked says, the fire, how you get how do scars? scars? And I, I, was like, I was like, I don't see any. And then like a minute later, you saw some scars on his yeah. back. And I'm like, well, you didn't see those. No, I couldn't tell. But uh, what what do I know? That's fine. Who's to say? Who's to say? Uh, what other tidbits you got for us? Uh, Such quick tidbits. <laughs> wasn't ready with the tidbits. No, we basically touched on everything. The main thing, the main thing that I'm that I'm thinking about, um, is this evolution thing, right? Because mm -hmm. the word evolution, I think, is 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 misleading, because that implies like the like maybe it's natural selection that they mean, but that's not as catchy. Well, like, my thought is is like, and you said it's the title of the next episode is evolution. evolution I, I I think to me that almost that almost solidifies my point that it's not that. Okay. Because they've done nothing but lie in their titles. Right. The last episode of Rick Grimes. Yeah, right. Well, this well this one w w was called Stradivarius. So. And there isn't one anymore. So they lied again. <laughs> See, <laughs> they just retroactively lie about everything. No, like uh, evolution would be if they reproduced the smartest ones, right? Yes. With somehow whatever. So like. Um, Either the smartest ones are staying alive the longest, which kind of runs against the like slowly decaying into nothing aspect of like yeah. zombies, which maybe they're not even doing. For well, the reason. evolution, <clears throat> if, if it were evolution yeah. for me, would would be that like okay, by the thirtieth wave of like biting and turning new people, yeah. something might have changed. I was gonna say like it wouldn't the, be like a like okay, the herd has gotten smarter as time went on because right. that that's like that's learning. That's what that's I was evolving. Uh, that's what I was leading up to was if the virus, if if the zombie virus is evolving, yeah, then that's a, a, like letting a, you maintain a, onto a more story. of your whatever, something. Right. Which they could have done maybe better if they had like saviors become zombies and still hate um, the you know. The, the non savior group or we something might have like that. that. Who's to say? We might have that, I guess. I don't know. So like that that would be the only way that I would like accept this is if new zombies retained like a like a single aspect of their previous thing, right? Uh -huh. Like like if the zombie you know version of Paisley or whatever shirt guy was somehow right went you know went more for the one person than the other, and you had this hint of like that's weird. Why you know why? Why did he walk past yeah, you? Why did he you know why did he ignore Sadiq? And, yeah, but we did not have that. that. Which, you know, you don't have to do everything no, no, I no. want to do. No, But you would think that something has to have, ha again, right? There has to be, uh, there can't have just been a smart zombie out there for the last 12 years, right? That's crazy. Well, um, there could have been. Or is it not? Uh, and they just happen to never see one, on, you know, until now? Yeah, it could just be certain people are affected by the virus differently, and, and, yeah. and the ones that have not have slowly found each other, you know, being that they are smarter and able to survive. Yeah. But I don't think that's it. I, again, I still think it's people. But, but again, uh, maybe it's not. That would be the greatest, hottest take, pull out of nowhere thing or whatever. It, you know, you know, if it was people, I almost want to bet that way, just for like the odds being so like mm -hmm. high. I'm like, holy shit, we called it, but I can't in good conscience say that. <laughs> that sounds so like my problem is that that wouldn't make sense, but the show doesn't have to make sense either. So like it, it's not gonna. I don't matter think I can way. picture a way of it working that does make sense. Right. So it doesn't matter. Okay. <laughs> no matter what it is, right? Yeah. Yeah, I know. All right. All right. So that's this we'll episode of The week. Walking Dead. Until next time well, with the uh, mid-season finale, let us know yeah. in the comments below what you thought about it. Don't die in a fire, and we will see you next time. Hello, Internets. I just love watching Just Taggers. If you've enjoyed this video as much as I have, click that subscribe button. <laughs> uh, peace out, homies.